I've never said this publicly before, but I'll tell, tell it here because it's, it's cool. Uh, Sash, uh, the great oh, big yeah. Sash with many, many hits over the years. I was a great fan of some of their stuff, uh, and I was listening to one of their tracks, and that track has a part where there's a little bit of similar sound to not my Sandstorm distorted lead sound, mm -hmm. but, mm. but b what it was before I distorted it. Hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I was listening to that track, analyzing it, making notes, and uh, my purpose was to build sort of an exact replica of the track in, mm -hmm. uh, you know, for learning purposes. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. so I had some chords going on and whatever, but none of that was used in Sandstorm except that f the idea for the distorted lead melody. But yeah, I was very pleasantly surprised when I heard the final orchestration played by the orchestra. It was mm. a truly heart-stopping and mesmerizing moment. Yeah. To hear that wall of sound coming mm -hmm. at you. Yeah. It was exactly like a sandstorm approaching. So how, how did you approach my track when, when you guys got to it? Well, so the thing is to kind of choose what's important and then it's like layering. It's very similar to mixing. Actually, it is mixing. Yes. I, I, th I think of orchestration as mixing, meaning that in a good mix, you know, you have stuff in the foreground and stuff in the background, mm -hmm. right? In my first orchestrations, they were kind of kind of bad, like mm -hmm. first orchestrations usually are, that everything was just on the foreground, right? Yeah. But then over the years, I've learned to place elements in, in various various yes. stages, you know, yeah. like some, some stuff is the main thing is in the front and then you have layers yeah. behind, right? Yeah, so pretty much this year we have, well, to sum it up, more everything, <laughs> but also from my personal perspective, because I, I feel like I could always do better. I learned in the process like how this sort of thing should be should be done in mm -hmm. my, my opinion. So I was kind of eager to do more because yeah. I think I can do a little bit better yeah. this time. And I, I, I think I, I managed to put some stuff in there. If the amount of emotions <laughs> is also Multiplied, 10 times, yeah. yes, I'm going to be in trouble because I'm very easily crying when you, know, when you exceed a certain level of threshold. It's, yeah. it's going to be tear hell afterwards. Yeah be that good or be, be that bad, but yeah. it's, it's going to involve a lot of crying and emotions.